shelf and put it in the garage. I can't find it nowhere. Good afternoon, friends. Happy Monday. Tonight, my brother, my husband is going to grill some chicken thighs. So I'm just going to get these salt and peppered. And then when they're close to being done, I'm going to have them baste them with barbecue sauce. So those are ready for him now. And while he's grilling them, I am going to put some of these little potatoes in the oven. I'm just going to season them up. Salt and pepper. Probably some ranch, powder ranch dressing. And then I'm also going to steam some cauliflower and a carrot. Okay, I'm going to drizzle this with some olive oil. Probably a tablespoon or so. A little bit of salt and pepper. And probably a tablespoon or so of this ranch dressing mix. And we'll give this a stir. Get everything in a single layer on the pan. And when my oven's preheated, these are going to go in there until they're tender and crisp on the outside, tender on the inside. And then I'm going to do some steaming of them vegetables. So I'll bring you back. Okay, friends, our potatoes are done. Carrots and cauliflower appear to be done. So now I'm just going to take these out and cover them with some shredded shark cheddar cheese. Set it back in the oven so the cheese can melt. The oven is off. Cheese is just going to get all melty. I'll bring you back when we plate up. Okay, friends. Our dinner is ready. This cheese got all nice and yummy melted. And I put our steamed vegetables in a dish with a little bit of butter. Now we can plate up. Just a little bit of cauliflower and carrot here. And then our easy cheesy ranch potatoes. They're hot. And our grilled chicken thighs. That's what's for dinner tonight. I hope you enjoyed this video. We'll see you tomorrow. Good afternoon, friends. Happy Tuesday.
Tonight I am going to make sausage pancake muffins. I need to preheat my oven to 350. And I saw Phelan from Moss Family TV do these. And I'm like, ooh, I gotta try them. So that's what I'm gonna make us for supper tonight. But I'm only doing half of the recipe. So, for half the recipe, I need one cup of complete pancake mix. And I am using Mrs. Butterworth's. And then in this bowl, I have my pork sausage already cooked up. And now I need a half a cup of cold water. Pour that in the pancake mix. Give this a good stir. And then I'm also going to cook us up some scrambled eggs. And I think that's going to need a little more water. And then I'm going to dump in the half a pound of cooked sausage. I'm going to spray six of these muffin tins. See how many this will give us. Okay, it gave us eight. They all look pretty even. So these are going to go in the 350 degree oven for 15 to 17 minutes. And then just before they get done, I'm going to scramble us up some eggs. I'll bring you back when we plate up. Okay, friends, our muffins are done pancake muffins are done and I scrambled this up a couple eggs these took 15 minutes and I have some syrup here to put on them Let's see. Hopefully they come out good. Oh, perfect. Pour some syrup on these. There you have it, friends. Scrambled egg and sausage pancake muffins. We'll see you tomorrow. Hey, you guys. I just wanted to come back on here and tell you what we thought of these pancake sausage muffins. They're very good. I highly recommend them. It be we'll definitely be doing that one again. We'll see you tomorrow.
Good afternoon, friends. Happy Wednesday. Tonight I'm just going to whip together a quick spaghetti dinner. Get this pot of water boiling. I'm going to preheat my oven 400 degrees for my garlic bread. And I always make this up ahead of time and keep it in the freezer so it's all ready to go. I put uh, garlic butter and mozzarella cheese and a little sprinkle of Italian seasoning on it. So there's the bread. And now I have my hamburger cooked up already. I'm going to get this heating up in this pan back here. along with extra spaghetti sauce from last week. Took this out of the freezer. Get that seasoned up. A little bit of onion powder. garlic powder and some basil leaves so I'm just going to get all this cooked up and heated up and the bed bread baked and I will bring you back when we plate up okay friends our dinner is ready so now I'm going to just drain this quick and add the spaghetti sauce Here's our garlic bread. That looks really good, don't it? All right. And there you have it. That's our dinner tonight. Spaghetti and garlic bread. We'll see you tomorrow. Good afternoon, friends. Happy Thursday. Tonight we are just cleaning up some leftovers. I took a container of our teriyaki chicken and rice bowls that we had, I don't know, last week or the week before. Figured we better eat this up. It was in the freezer. So I just heated that up. And we're going to clean up the last of my cheesy salsa that was in the fridge. With the last of these tortilla chips. And that's our dinner tonight. Quick and easy. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And please subscribe to my channel. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.